India, we uh, should discuss more in depth about uh, this uh, emerging superpower as uh, it will mark for sure the new decade. As from 2010 until 2020, the fight was between USA and China due to economic war, fiercely competition and technology race. From 2020 to 2030, I believe that uh, the fight will uh, switch uh, between China and India because there it will be a fight mainly on uh, population supremacy. India is going to overcome China. Geography and access, allies, resources and access. So let's discuss more in detail that um, India has a um, few advantages such as um, good ethics in business and life in general, ambition, spirituality, wisdom, flexibility as accepting all type of religion, nuclear power, it is a nuclear power and it will be more influential. Uh, it's uh, very innovative and also persistent has support from the US and other powers. Uh, these advantages are as follows, borders, conflict in the Northwest uh, to Pakistan in uh, Kashmir area, in um, the area of Nepal, so Northeast, are there three uh, territories mentioned in the presentation and uh, China in the north on Tibet, which is the toughest region. Intriguing geography also, due to the fact that uh, India is uh, almost entirely exposed to um, the sea and the waves, and it uh, can be quite mm, difficult to to support the, the territory um, due to, um, let's see, a tsunami or um, climate change or even climate warming, it will be a very difficult situation and uh, the population will be devastated because um, most of the population is concentrated on the shore of the um, peninsula, the Indian Peninsula, and actually it's a subcontinent and it's largely exposed, that's why it's uh, quite a uh, big disadvantages. And it uh, also has a few advantages due to access in uh, all the Indian uh, Ocean. And also it's very difficult to um, to be in charge on a diverse land with diverse population. China on the other side has the advantage of being competitive, firm, so it will uh, easily um, manage a negotiation. Has also discipline, it's uh, fast as uh, thinking and acting, has rigidity and uh, atheist population infrastructure so um, it's quite uh, more logical and organized but has disadvantages such as cruelty as, as behavior see conflicts surrounded by u.s allies uh, shamed by u.s and others and um, controlling the population and uh, suppress also the the people but india and china has also similarities in uh, smart people huge cultures asian heritage and rich resources what do you think i think uh, that um, 
India has good chances to overcome China and to become quite a great power and to influence the world for the next decade.